Hello, this is Eli from SafeNet has technical support. Today I'm going to talk about the toolbox which is part of the vendor suite. I will choose work offline. The toolbox is a very powerful tool in which one can use the runtime API, the HASP runtime API, here are the list of the runtime API on the left pane. For instance, if I use HASP login, I get here the parameters that I will be using for this HASP login. For instance, now I see that feature ID is zero and the event code to be used is demo MA, which is the demonstration one. And once I click on execute, I get the result of has status OK. It is successful. The login has been successful. Now let's see if I see, can see this login in the admin control center. What I will do, I will open Internet Explorer and choose localhost with port 1947. I will right away go to sessions. And in the session, I can see that there is a session to feature number zero. If we go back to this, to this toolbox, I can go to login and press on execute. Status is OK. And then I can see that the session in the admin control center is gone now because the logout was uh, uh, successfully done. <coughs> now, if we go to any of these uh, runtime APIs, it doesn't matter which one, you are able not only to make changes and to use this runtime API, but you are able also to see the source code over here. And this is the very same source code that you are going to use in your application in order to use the runtime API. Moreover, you can use in file settings toolbox, you are able to change the language to be used. So it can reflect over here in the source code. So you, you might even copy paste from this source code into your application in order to work with the Hasp Runtime API. I hope the toolbox will be very beneficial and useful for your work. Thank you very much for watching.